Welcome to part 13 of the Western Roman Empire for Total War Attila. Now in the last part we came down here, we wiped out, I can't remember who these guys were called now, it's a little while since I recorded part 12, but we've now consolidated Mauritania. We've got these armies moving up to kind of take out the Dimidity. And the north we kind of consolidated our position up here and well we're in a reasonable position here what I, but what I've kind of want to do is we roll the turnover I want to see if I can get Welcome, peace with these but guys expect scant pleasantries. Our wits no, are not they've rejected it oh well but I think when I was looking before I started I, I did pick the right one isn't it I'm out. But and we've got these armies here. Kind of want to get this army back so that it can start to refurbish. And I also looked at this bit here. And I'm going to cancel this here. And I'm going to move this priest over here. And this priest into Carfanego. And going to see if we can stabilize this area with priests and a bit of building. I think I can get something in here that's a bit more useful than uh, a baptistry and that will also save me money. We've got a bit of cash to spend now because I've uh, done here. we got this guy here who's not particularly very happy and the which we need to sort out building this fleet up so let's have a quick look to see what we can spend that remaining little bit of cash on Malaga now and this area here actually I'm gonna hang on to the money I think I mean, we could yep we got a little bit building up here yeah I think I'm gonna just hang on to the cash let's go for an end turn Our struggle will end badly and peace with treaty. little honor for anyone. Yep, I'll Excellent. take the peace treaty with the Dukes. I mean, at the moment I'll take a peace treaty with kind of anyone who really, really wants to make it because I want to concentrate totally in Africa. That's the one area where I won't make peace, but up here in the north, I'm quite happy to, to go with the status quo. And... is Ithaca. I mean the Romans are still up here causing trouble. Oh, Britannia's been destroyed. Noble birth. We got a bit of a noble birth. Let's actually just have a quick look at the family tree. I could would really love to recruit somebody here. We've got a 27 year old governor in Aquitania. You're a bit boring but I think maybe and I think what we're going to try and do is we're going to try and adop, adopt, ad, adopt this guy, this governor. I think it could be useful to have him in the family. We and we're going to bring these guys up. Not going to rush. I think we're just upgrade these guys, give them a Ready bit more clout, and well, we can't only really recruit do with maybe we'll just leave that for the moment because we don't really Commander. need these guys very expensive I think what we'll do at the moment is just Ready for battle. We need good fighters. recruit a couple more spears here we got quite a lot of cash but this is the area I need to work on deploy you that actually makes you positive but Cordoba's negative so I think we could
could go up, make the build a theatre there. What do you wish of me? That makes you positive, you positive. See if anyone else has got theatrica. Yeah, well, we've just fixed that. Lagnesis. You've got some sanitation going now, so that actually kind of. You've actually got a little bit of food now, so can, does that mean I can I tax the province? No, you're still minus 16, I think. And we can't build anything here. That's a real pain in the neck. But I think you've got there, but Octodurum. I think what I want to do we is get you. Battle down into this area Come on and I'm going to put this army to your duties, here men. at your command because Octodurum's kind of nice and strong but uh, there's nothing I can do about the kind of thing but I don't what I'd like to do is keep this Ready guy in reserve in case I need to move him down here because we got this lot floating around being general generally obnoxious as well I think what I'm gonna do here is actually yep we'll take you you're nice and cheap and you can kick it kick ass a little bit I think we're build up these guys give them a bit more clout and federati spears right so we got 6000 left to spend let's have a quick run round here I do want to. Actually, what's the sanitation? Sanitation, sorry. Fertility is. It's plentiful, which means that that could be useful. I think we'll put a field in there. And got a governor's palace here. Really. By, by building any governor's palaces here yet. Yep. So I think you've got recruitment of agents. You don't have a. You, how about over here? You don't have a governor's palaces. I think I'm kind of inclined to. Let's have a quick look. Enables recruitment provides garrison. I think maybe this, because this is the capital, so I think maybe if we do that, we will be able to strengthen that, because champions can walk. Well, they better be able to walk. So I think that's all we can do this turn. Um, I'm just going to go for an end turn. God almighty, not quite right. You certainly... That gets you up a little bit. See what we can do here. Personal influence. Research. Well, we'll give you that. And we'll give you that. And we may have to... 30 turns. Well, we may have to kind of um, decimate that navy from time to time. Oh, looks like the... I think that's the Ebdanians are going to be coming south, so we're going to have to get ready to deal with them. Enjoy this quiet time. <sighs> it ends now. Okay. The storm is coming. A storm of blood to wash you away. We're, we'll just accept that. So like the Eastern Romans are getting ready to knock up against the 
Garamanthians down there. I think they're the Garamanthians. And the Huns are obviously up to something, as usual. I mean, I, in some ways I hope the Eastern Romans don't take that settlement, because I want it. But obviously the first priority is going to be uh, Dimity. And then we will move against that settlement and... Kind of, because having our one wares have one merits here. which would appeal to your people, and yep. trade enriches all. Yep, this I'm is quite a happy to and a nice trade agreement that could be quite useful. And these guys are coming down. So what have we got here? Term of office, term of office. Our respectable. Oh, we've got a civil war, so that means we've got some. Bloody prat here, yeah, there he is. At your command. And we're gonna go up Stand here. And they're gonna run away, but I think we'll be able to capture them. Would that I were as swift as the angels. Just get rid of them because I don't want them causing public disorder issues. Chicken shit troublemakers. Ready for orders. Yep, they're dead, so that gets rid of the... And of course these guys can't get back. But they're just gonna have to take the attrition. And... This will give these guys a bit more... Or give the general a bit more experience. Only gonna... Give you that. Morale... Zeal plus one. I think you've got plenty of zeal. Melee, defense, commanding force. Yep, I think we're certainly going to give you that. Right, down in Africa. Ready for orders. That here, campaign movement range disabled. So we we can only. I think we're move you to there. On the move. Is that all? Move you to there as well. And you have further orders? Yeah. Commander. Let's do two of these guys. I mean they're a little bit expensive, they're double in price. But I think we can live with that. Right, let's Theatica, yeah. Got the theatre underway. You don't have a lot in sanitation. Are, are you deployed? You're deployed, yeah. You've turned round nicely. You turn round nicely. You've got a bit of what of father. We're certainly gonna give you that because that will probably improve that even more. Let's see what we can get over here. You're a little bit on the edge. Got a reservoir here. Could take you up. How's the sanitation here? Oh, sanitation's good. I think we'll get a wheat field in there. And part of me says, should I be taking up this garrison? if the getting the unwelcome coming down here we may need it and we got great press here got no sanitation so we're gonna have to be a bit careful on that you're coming up quite nicely I really really want to I need to get my cash up here I could take that up. Yep, I think we're got a governor's palace in there. I mean, it's going to consume a little bit of food, but we've got some. And we could take up the, the sewers. And that will give us a bit more sanitation. It costs us a bit more maintenance. What do we have down here? How's 
Yeah, you're doing okay. Sewers. Go up 2,500. But that's going to increase the. That only will only lift the sanitation one. That will give eight to everyone. But we will lose growth. I've got more interest in growth there at the moment. Here. I think you're quite happy. God stop prevaricating. You've got this coming up here. And got the cattle herd here. I think we're gonna put the wheat field in here. Two and again I am kind of a bit inclined here to go a bit growthy. And yeah, I think we'll spend the money on a bit of growth and a wheat field over here that will give us a bit more income. And Actually, no, I'm sorry, I'm backtracking a bit here. I think I've kind of invested a bit too much in here. I am gonna do that and then maybe come back to here for the week. I think we, we need the extra garrison here in case these, those that shower come rolling down. I think my family. I think we'll get you in as a master of horse. Oh, we've got oh the guy. This guy actually joined the family, so I think we'll get you in here. And I think we'll get you in here. You in here. And I think you need to get in here. So we've now got families grown a bit. I will get you married. And that would be useful. And, and you can see the loss of income due to have not having those guys in position. Uh, right, got a spy here. I certainly want you because we might need to do some I am a shadow. assassinations if anyone comes close. Got this governor here, this is you're the governor in Africa. So I'm certainly gonna army recruitment capacity. Yep, certainly gonna go with that. Oh, well, I'll give you that just in case you get into the wars. And here come the Ebdanians. So we're gonna have to kind of come and kick them off. I mean, as long as these guys up in the north are quite happily doing their thing. Oh, yeah, yeah thank you, Swaby. I'm quite happy for you to, to do that, just to chase them off. Obviously, Africa's teamed up with the Eastern Romans, so I might actually lose out with Garamara. But that's the way it goes that's the breaks oh, at the end of the day I mean so Africa Theria Palmyria and I think political favours power respectable power respectable power respectable so we've now got up to here. So, and of course we've got our cash back. And this That's army, they come down and declare war. We're not going to call our allies in. Any glory you and sway be coming automatically. Like it's going to encircle. I think this hire up some mercenaries. It's, I know it's not the sporting thing to do, but I, were as swift as the angel. I just want to. Oops. And that gives 
this is two full stack armies and I'm just going to auto resolve this guys purely simply because I don't particularly want to fight a siege battle so I'm brain went a bit faint there and we're just going to occupy we hunger for battle. and of course what we're going to do now is At your command. get rid of all these mercenaries actually let's get rid of two of them and I love love these camel warriors but they're very very expensive and I think we'll merge up these guys as well save a bit of cash Ready for battle. you're okay and Ready for orders. Ready for these battle. guys had there so Ready for orders. and I think Ready for battle. You can't move in. We hunger for and battle. I think you can just stand there. Oh no, you might as well just go back anyway. Ready for Oops. further orders. Bugger. At your command. Should have upgraded these guys. What we got here? Horse breeder. I think we'll repair that for the moment. Large stealer field. I think that's going to have to get knocked down. I think we're going to knock this down one because it's got public order issues I think if we go down to I think we'll just go for simple gem deposits to start with in fact we may have to knock that down completely to stabilize it Ready for actually battle. what I might do is swap these armies around I'm not sure why I actually bothered to move this army up because this really needs to be the more mobile army to come over to deal with this area We've got this army here and of course we spent a lot of our cash on this part so let's have a quick look killed and the Cthulhu are gone which was the idea behind what I was trying to do let's get, have a quick Beatica part of me says kind of whack that up in this area kind of get a bit of stability but let's have a look at my Natalia let's see what we can do here you're doing okay Ligeria yeah one more turn and you'll be able to get uh, Balasare you've got a little bit of but that's going to be affected by I don't particularly want that one more turn Sierra Cruz let's have a quick look at the fertility down here yep so down here we could part of me says cattle herd squalor oh we got negative pub public order but we can get that sorted out uh, wheat field that gives me 92 field 150 that gives me 200 I think we're gonna go with the cattle herd here because we've got we can supplement this with uh, the actual food wise if push comes to shove we can supplement it with the what we call it the fishing wolf this has got yeah you've got plenty so I think we'll take you up as well and we've got a bit of a space here but I wouldn't know what I want to build there for the moment got some sanitation going there what I'm really really interested in at the moment is kind of strengthening the food situation because when we reach 425 we're going to take a little bit of a and Ready I think we're going to get you back across the pass to Medellantum Ready for battle. and yeah you guys are quite happily yes take you up I think that I think we do need to 
Got to start strengthening these garrisons. Right, so we've got Dimity here that's probably going to be. And what we've got here, Priest here, topped out, so we might as well just. we got the Spy here. Certainly going to want you to have the ability to assassinate. These guys have got some traditions, certainly going to give you that to strengthen up when in foreign territory, public order, local province, certainly going to give you that. Oh, and there's the Abdanians coming back. That's Swaby have provided a nice distraction for the Abdanians. Delaying their inevitable arrival down into my area. And that will give me more time to build up that garrison. And of course the Abdanians are pushing back, which is nice. Because again that kind of gives me more capability to come down this way and these guys are still kind of duking it out I mean at the end of the day if the Eastern Romans wipe out the Garamantians I'm not going to complain it's just that it's going to make it a bit of a pain in the neck stabilizing Dimity Dimity or something like that so we may have to keep us an army there the peace honestly forged between yep, men I will, I'm if certainly going to take that because that's another buffer that I don't have to worry about we hunger for battle. right so I think we're going to get you across the Caesarea going to it, get you Set up the watch. down into Dimity and Commander. we can just kind of upgrade these guys Give them a bit of clout to see what we've got here. So we're going to convert you. We're going to leave that there. A Latin shrine. Is that the only thing that's going to give me public order here? I think, I suppose, maybe we will have to go with that. Because that, no, it's no sanitation. I want to knock that down. I will go for sanitation here. I've got more interest in sanitation over over. I think we'll just leave the horse horse breeder in here for the moment. That will give us thirty six food. And could really do with an agent. How's the? I think what we may do is move our spy up this way keep him in this area for the moment because we may need them and then I think see the moment part of this public order comes from we've got plenty of food plenty of sanitation I think what we're going to do is we're going to put a theater in here just going to take up a lot of the money but what that will mean is that by having a theatre here that will improve the public order which will allow that army and I can use my spy for better purposes <sighs> Beatica you're still what you're one turn away from uh, Brigantium you're kind of just doing quite well here we could get more food in here, but you've got plenty of food. Let's just have a quick Skype round to see anyone who's suffering. You've got plenty of food. You've got you're a little bit low, so I think maybe we need to get some fields into Talentum. We could get an auditorium up here. That could be good. Carfinigo, but let's just have a quick look. Aquas Sextus. 
you. You really need to do something. And scriptorium to burner. Why did I build that? I think we're going to knock that down actually and get in uh, Governor's Palace there I think that could be more useful do a bit more growth here or maybe a bit more public order actually that was a public order in this area it's brilliant but it's only due to and we've got a bit of cash here but at the same time we've now completed this so we've got a bit of peace, so what I'm going to do is bring you back this way. Waiting for more orders. You can get there 150, you're 187. So I think we'll get rid of you. Sign up, lads, for a good and glorious life. Four of you. Ready for battle. And get rid of one of you. It is a great Recruit and another glorious one of you thing to serve your people. So that these guys, we can, uh, I mean, it's not a small amount of money, I know. And you guys can say, ah, oh, you know, why are you doing that? But I think at the end of the day, those small amounts m kind of, you know, you can see the difference there. I mean, that's 40 gold put it over kind of several armies that's going to be quite a, a substantial bit of cash and I think that's all I can do for this part so if we're going to go for an intern we could drop something in here but what would I want to put in here so we're going to go for an intern got our priest here we'll just kind of drop that there got a general here who's quite right. What can we get in here? Zeal plus two. I think we're, that could be quite nice. Get your zeal right up. Hey, we're certainly going to get you know, my fighting force, so I think we're kind of build you up here. Oh yeah, you, you've lost some due to attrition. And what we're going to try and do is move that army up, and my oh, picks have decided to do protection. That's going to hurt. Road to Magus always seems to get it in the neck. Every every total war campaign I've ever fought, the one city that always gets raised is always under constant attack. Is Road to Magus. I'm not sure why. Uh, it's almost like the all the all the factions round there hate that city. And the Garamanthians are still kind of banging away here. And kind of having a set to with the Eastern Romans. I'm quite happy Your with that. Your generals are true soldiers of the good Join lord. The war against the Franks. We ask you today no, to sorry about that, guys. I oh, know I'm not being a very good ally, but... My focus is on Africa at the moment. And that's where I want my army to be. Faction destroyed the Swaby. Oh, that's a shame. We've lost a bit of trade. You want promotion? Okay, we're we'll lose control, but where, where, where did you want to be promoted to? Imperial Master of Foot. We've got a vacancy here. Oh well, I'm not sure why he wants to be promoted, but and I think.
think were get you married. Oh, she's now old enough to marry, so you're 26. We got a general here who's 28 in Mauritania. Have we got any more governors? No, we got we got a 28 year old general in Mauritania. Not quite right, but I think we'll get marry you into the family. Hopefully, you will accept. And and I think we're. I mean, I could double time this army over, but can't really see the point. We're not in a rush. These guys, let's get you a, a couple of these guys. Got a nice bit actually. Dimity, we'll just keep banging you down for the moment. We finished the research. I can't remember what I was researching. Oh, I think I was researching that. We've now got Legetio Competensis, Catafactory, Catafari. I think I would like to come this way first. That's integrity, and that gives me. Yeah, I think we're going to try and complete this area first, get the area, and we can. And then we'll probably push out with some more. So what research did we finish? Development in, in intermeter martial regulations, which was uh, this one here. So we can go to a tier three now. And of course we're going to keep this guy moving up. Caesar is minus four, but we should be able to pull that round now with when that goes up. Cordoba, I think we're... Why are you minus three still? Immigrants, difficulty level, taxes, religious differences. I think we'll put that up here. And is this where I demolished the. No. Where did I demolish the. God, I'm getting old. Old and forgetful. And. Oh, I think it was Aquitania, wasn't it? I want a capital in here. Get this going. We can get an order theatre going here as well, but maybe we can. And this, I want this to be a bit of a powerhouse. And we could get a theatre here. Strengthen up this. We got plenty of food in this area, so. And Ready for orders. this army's pretty strong, so I think we're going to take you out to Octodurum, and we kind of a little bit of kind of peace going Commander. here, like Nignum. You're in there, so I think what we can do is sneak you back into here. Waiting for orders. Get rid of these guys. And soldiering. It's a good life. Get you. Actually, you can probably go as well. It is Recruit a great you. and Get four Balasari here for my assault army. I think you guys are now. And you garrison. can get back into this area. 
I'm not sure why I'm looking at mercenaries, but and you've got a little bit of a force. I think we'll get you a couple more spears just to get this art, keep build this army up. And I think that's all we can do this turn, guys. It all says we can expand here. So. These armies are nearly ready to go. We'll get the spy, can get down and see what's going on. Got a general here, certainly want you to. Actually, I think what we're going to do is cancel that. My wits and words are yours. May assign a provincial governor. Okay. Do I have anyone spare? Nope. Magnet. Where are we find out a patron? Magnet is wealth. Wealth. Magnet. You have 35. This is where we have to take a guess. Off from industrial buildings. Cultural buildings. I think that's better. Oh, have we lost a governor in Africa? Okay, it's... Somebody die? And let's see what we can do. Religious research, Christian influence, corruption, food production, public order, disease decreases non-Latin Christian minus four non-Latin Christian province corruption minus five I'm not sure exactly sure what that actually does did, so did we actually did somebody actually die then balance of power I thought I had a oh natural causes 444? That's not fair in the world. That is definitely not fair. And what I'm actually going to do is. Oh, these guys actually got some. Okay. Actually, let's cancel that. These, you might get a bit of extra rank next turn round. So we've actually got a little bit more cash to spend. If we can get any more farming stuff done. Any amateurs. It's probably not. Video. Yeah, we can. Talentum. Carfinego. I think we can get. House of squ Sanitation and Squalor here. Yeah, you're good. Get a cattle herd in there. Get a bit more cash going. I mean, we'll probably suffer food-wise, but so, the Abdanians. That looks like it's a bit damaged, so we might be able to kind of do a little bit of damage to them. Looks like Africa's actually taken. Oh, that's a pain in the neck. Does that mean I'm going to have to go to war with Africa? Factions have gone. Noble birth. Rebellion in the Sahara. I just have to decree it. You take a hand. And I think you've got. You're pretty close to rebellion, but I think you guys can kick ass if necessary. I think we're going to have to bring you down here, which will probably mean that you will have problems, but we're going to come down here. Now this is going to be a problem, in the sense that if Africa's taken that, I'm going to have to declare war on Africa, which definitely means that we need to... Oh, we didn't gain anything from that was a waste of time. 
and could really do with a bit more cavalry. Let's just grab that. I know these guys are a bit expensive, but I do like my camel radius. Population increase in Lagnesis. Lugnum. And I think we're ready for battle. What's the public order? Food consumption. You've got no food consumption here. Actually we can because no, because we can't, so we actually need a forum here. We build a forum. We can then go to that and oh we can't build a food market yet bugger um. so we're just gonna have to to Durham is still kind of hanging in there but it's not yeah, yeah, quite happily staring over the border at these guys. Demolition on the Steeler Field, yeah, well, that's down here. And what can we get in here? And it's only going to get the sanitation in here to sort that out. And we're going to have to up the which is gonna be a pain but Tinkerous you're still I think I'm gonna get a governor's palace in here because I don't want this area going unstable. You know, stability in cash is about everything here and food. Um, yeah one more turn and you'll be ready to go part of me down here says let's take up you've got the food I think we're take up or let's as well just to strengthen these garrisons from these oiks and again we've got no cash we're gonna have to look at Narbo next time round Maybe if we've got plenty of cash, our I think we might go straight for that and spend all our cash in one big whack. So we're going to go for an end turn. This will be the last one for this part, guys. I, I think we've done. Oh, they're going to—they're trying to be a bit smart. They're going to trying to go out round us. But if that's what you want to do, I'm quite happy to oblige you. I think what I might do is move my army, well, I have to keep one army defending Lugnesis and Octodurum dealing with any rebels and then maybe move an army down towards Iberia because I certainly don't want the Ebdanians kind of wrecking that area. So, oh, it's the Quadrians coming in. They're at peace with us, but... No, oh, they look like they're a horde. We might be able to... Very, very tempted. Rebellion in them in, in Sahara, yes, well... That goes without saying. Let's get you up here. See what the Africans are defending with. Oh, that's... At your command! That's quite a big force. What have you got? You got a small army there at the moment. We hunger for battle. And I think we're gonna March. bring you Your next command. down to here. 
I'm not too worried about that area there. Um, oh, you're going to be 9 of 16. That's going to be a pain in the neck. You guys are going to rebel next time out, but we fix the sanitation one more turn and we will have a small garrison here. And Commander. I'm kind of in a crushing mood at the moment. At your command. Um, Ready for orders. Actually, this is where I'm going to leave it, guys, because we, we're on a kind of an, a knife edge here. And Ready for order. part of me says I want to come in and destroy this Pictish army. Commander. But that would be for the next part. And if we destroy the Pictish army, that's we'll release this army to kind of take up a position down here to deal with any kind of Ebdanians coming this way. And that army's been there too long as it is. So this is where I'm going to leave it, guys. Hope you've enjoyed the episode, and until next time, whatever you do, enjoy your gaming.